You ready, yeah? Yeah, alongside the uh, Dover manager and his start. Nice to get a last minute equaliser. Yeah, it's normally the other way around, isn't it? So, uh, yeah, I thought we showed great character today again, you know. I think they made eight changes from their team last week. We, we certainly couldn't do that. Um, we made a couple, but and we've had a tough week with illness. There's a lot of boys, you know, Ryan had to come off today. He was really struggling at half time. And I thought he had a great game. I thought he was excellent, you know, and he came off just because he's, he was really struggling. But he was excellent. Um, I thought that was all that we dug in, you know. I think we, we, we've actually created a better clear-cut chance, believe it or not. You know, the two 1v1s. I mean, that kid's not had any 1v1 uh, shots to save. Um, they had some way, they could have been three yeah, up early they doors. Could have, they could have been, but that's, you know, they're not, for me, they're, you know, keepers done his job a couple of times, and yeah, they've had a couple of chances, but listen, we have as well. You know, we come away from home, and, you know, two one-on-ones, and Michael's had another one, and, and then we get two goals. We deserve to get two goals. Like I say, I think, um, I think it's a, it's a fantastic point for the boys. They've earned it again today. Uh, under difficult circumstances. I'm sure they'll be a little bit disappointed with their season, I've got to say, because you look at their squad, I'm sure the emphasis is getting in the past this season and uh, obviously they haven't achieved that. They've got the FA Trophy for me, but I'm sure they're remit at the start of season to try and get in the playoffs with the squad they've got. Unfortunately, they haven't, but I wish them well in the FA Trophy. Early in main instant was uh, Almady early on. Do you think he should have been red carded with the playing on? 100%. You know, do you know what though, I've got to say, the referee has actually caused that problem because it was a foul on the Bromley player. He was putting his shirt. If he blows the whistle, none of that happens. None of it happens, he stops it, he carries it on, right? and then, but when you're like, yeah, for me, when he does that, he should be sent off. Yeah, he's he played his arm, surely, it's, it's his arm other way. Yeah, and he got that wrong, the ref, and, uh, you know, but it, it could have been avoided with, it, with giving the foul early doors, and, uh, but listen, it is what it is, and, he got away with one there, the lad, but uh, you know, I'm just pleased that you know we, we changed it a little bit near the end. Ransom, yeah, centre forward. Yeah, we just listen, why not? Chuck him up, try and occupy that centre half. To be fair, he was involved with the first game, he a lovely header across goal. Yeah, great header. Uh, brilliant for Dan, you know, I'm pleased for him there. Again, he's had a, another good game, Danny. And uh, you know, he's had a good season, Danny Cross. Like I say, with a few in there with illness, dug it, dug in, young Henry Woods in midfield again today. I thought he, he worked hard today, didn't he? He's been struggling all week, so yeah, pleased. That, that gives you, you know, one point on the board. Yeah. Um, okay, when, you can see, when you concede it in the 90th minute, what's your feelings then? Well, I'm going to have to do it next week now, time big one. So, uh, yeah, no, it was nice. And, you know, we obviously went in, went in the second goal, went in 2-2. Two, two, oh, we went back, obviously, we <laughs> sent Harry back to try and hang on to the, to the point we got. And, uh, and we got it. So, yeah, it was, it's nice because we wanted to do that. Um, I'm just pleased the lads just kept going and they've kept going over the last few weeks. We haven't performed at home, but yeah, really, we've done it away from home. We, we need to really try and go and put performance on next uh, Sunday for, for the fans to turn up and uh, hopefully we can do that. Yeah, you haven't gone two games unbeaten all season. I presume that's an aim and there's well, another aim to try and not concede any goals to get to the magical 100 goal mark. Well, yeah, that's right. And, uh, so it'd be nice to go, as you say, two games unbeaten. <laughs> and there's no reason why we can't next week. It won't be an easy game. Both teams are down. It's not easy for both teams. But, you know, the one thing we'll do, we'll keep going, and I'm sure Wayne will as well next week. I don't mean to put it, every single Saturday this season, you haven't won a game. How does it feel? How does your Saturday feel when you haven't won a game of football? Uh, yeah, tough. Very <laughs> tough. But hopefully that change next week. That's on the Sunday, so it can't oh, do it. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, I keep forgetting about that. Yeah, so it can't change. Well, no, it's, it's been tough. But, uh, I just, I was pleased for the fans today. Again, they, 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 they did celebrate how they won the league. Yeah, yeah, no, but, yeah, fair play to them. You know, they're behind us. They understand us. You know, like I said, I was talking to a couple of from the uh, fans uh, when I turned up, and they, they thought that we'd been harshly dealt, uh, dealt with uh, from, from the start of the season. I felt that the league probably should have stopped last season when, when we stopped when we decided we weren't going to play. You know. Um, which is a fair comment, everyone's got their views on it, but I know there's a lot of people with football have uh, have been right behind us and understood our situation. Brilliant, enjoy your evening. Oh,